everyone. Welcome back. It's Taylor from Tailored Expressions, and I am sharing with you today part two of my video series on Tailored Expressions, Inc. So in part one of my video series, I shared about two of my favorite features, the coverage and the blendability of our inks. So you can see this is a piece of paper that I stamped during my part one video that shows the really beautiful coverage you get even when you continue stamping generationally with our inks. Now I was gonna use the same piece of paper to illustrate another one of my favorite features, which is our color matching. So we have 30 different colors of ink and we have those cardstocks to coordinate. So I have here to show you our Cookie Monster cardstock and ink, how wonderfully that matches. And then you can see over here, we have strawberry milkshake. And then we also have this green color, which is pea pod. So you can see how those match just perfectly with the inks. And that really takes the guesswork out of your crafting because you can just be confident that when you grab the ink and the cardstock that match, you will have just what you need to make the perfectly coordinated card. So that is one of the features that I love. And another one, I'm not sure I would call this a reason to invest, but I always like to mention it because it's one of my favorite parts of our ink, and that is the names we've selected. So all of our inks are named after foods and drinks. So we have things like Cookie Monster, Pea Pod, and Strawberry Milkshake, like I mentioned. We also have Lemon Meringue, and Sweet Basil, and Pumpkin, and fun drinks like Pink Champagne, and Mint Julep. And and so they just make me smile and it's one of the things that I love about our inks. So I always try to mention that as well. So next I'm gonna talk about some of the different properties of our ink in the different formulations that we have. So I'm gonna bring in and show you our two colors here, chocolate truffle and Oreo. And you'll notice on the top of the pad, it says premium hybrid ink pad. Now our other ink pads will say premium dye ink pad. So what's different about a hybrid ink? Well, there are different things that you can do with a hybrid ink. For example, if you like coloring with Copic markers, our Oreo and chocolate truffle hybrid inks are alcohol marker compatible. I have an image that I've stamped here on sugar cube cardstock, and then I have one of my Copic markers, and I'm just gonna show you if I really saturate, even coloring over the top of that line that is stamped on the cardstock, it is not going anywhere. So for those of you who like to color with Copics, you know how important it is to use both a cardstock and an ink that will allow you to get the best results with your Copic markers. And I would highly recommend our chocolate truffle and Oreo inks. Now, another thing you can do with these two inks is they are waterproof. So they make great ink for stamping outline images and then watercoloring them. I have stamped the same bird here onto our 118 pound watercolor cardstock. So if you haven't tried that, it's really awesome. I highly recommend that as well. So next I'm just gonna take this water brush. It just has water in it. And you can see if I squeeze water out onto the paper and really just kind of move that water around, you're not getting any um, seepage of the line there. It is staying right in place. So this makes it a great ink for water coloring as well. And there's not even any need to heat set the ink before uh, you start working with the water. So, in my mind, the reason for doing these two colors of ink in the hybrid formulation is that if you are going to color your image with markers or watercolor, you're probably gonna stamp that outline image in black or brown. So these are the only two colors in our collection that offer these specific properties uh, for use. But next I want to talk to you some more about our dye ink. So I mentioned before that all of our other colors are premium dye ink pads. So that means that they dry quickly, they're acid free, they're fade resistant, all of those wonderful things that you love about dye ink pads. But there is something different and special about our uh, dye ink. So most dye inks are water-based, which means that you can watercolor with them. You can dip your brush right onto the ink pad and then watercolor with them. Ours is a little bit different for, from that. It is a more permanent archival ink, which means that you can stamp it on multiple surfaces and it will actually dry on those surfaces and be 
not able to wipe off. So if you were to stamp this particular ink on acetate, it would take a little bit longer to dry than it would just on normal cardstock, but it would dry and be permanent on that surface. So that's another fun thing that you can do with our inks that might be a little bit different than what you're used to. So with the three things that I talked about today, the different um, formulations that allow you to color with Copic markers, to watercolor with a waterproof ink, to stamp on many different surfaces, and also the color matching with our cardstock, I hope you got a little bit more information about what I love about our ink so much. And if you missed part one, you still have a chance to check that out and learn more about the coverage and the blendability. So thank you guys for tuning in today. You can find all of our ink on our website at tailoredexpressions.com. Bye guys.